As a child, you most likely slept with a nice blanket or a stuffed animal. That one thing that made you feel better when nothing else did. Perhaps now you are in your 20s and 30s, working a 9 to 5 job and still have your stuffed animal from when you are 6 and 7 years old, given to you by your grandparents or parents. You used to bring it with you everywhere you traveled, whether it's the weekend or a vacation. Unable to sleep without it. It's always hidden because you don't want to be laughed at, but it's always there. During the first 6 months, nearly every newborn finds an object to call their own and builds a bond with it. A child who has been emotionally abused always carries a stuffed animal with them because stuffed animals takes on unique personalities in child's imagination and after forming a connection children learn to rely on it to help them to cope up with their anxieties which benefits in sleep. It's no surprise that the same object re-enters our lives when we reach adulthood and leave home for the first time supporting us in working through feelings of insecurities. also generating a sense of stability and minimizing the negative sensations like loneliness and anxiety in 2017 survey of 2000 individuals in the united states by build bear and atomic research found that 40% of respondent sleep with their stuffed animals by their side 72% said they would keep their stuffed animal forever moreover 56% of respondent have kept their stuffed animals for more than 2 decades It's enough evidence to support the notion that holding on to your stuffed animal isn't so strange even though some people may assume that an adult holding to a toy animal is a sign of immaturity but this is not the case according to Stuart Brody a psychological professor at the University of West of Scotland there was no link between having a stuffed animal as an adult and emotional intelligence because anything that helps us to handle our feelings and helps us to get a better night's sleep especially without use of drugs or alcohol could be seen as a benefit several studies have demonstrated that interacting with animals reduces stress and can significantly lower your stress hormones on the other hand touching a soft stuff animal can have similar effects with that said if your attachment to your stuff animal impacts your work or relationships that's a usually sign of a deeper issue that needs to be addressed The bottom line is humans are a socializing animal that suffers when isolated from others. While stuffed animals cannot totally replace the role of other people in our lives, but they can assist us in dealing with the interconnected modern world by minimizing emotions of isolation and separation. All we can say is that it's a small investment for a good night's sleep. I hope you found this video informative. 